Now, let's pretend that this is our data set. Of course, the real data set um, is going to be much larger. But um, let's say I want to create a pie chart for the variable gender. So what I have to do is go to the Analyze menu and then click on Descriptive Statistics, Frequencies. And here you have a list of all the variables in the data set. Now obviously not all of them are going to be appropriately used for a pie chart. Uh, I'm going to select here the variable that I want, which is gender, and then click on this arrow. This is a list of the variables for which we are going to create our chart. And then I'm going to click on the chart button and I'm going to select pie chart and here I want to see the percentages if you click on frequencies you're going to see the actual numbers what I want to see um, are the percentages so I'm going to click here then continue and then OK now the way SPSS works is that the output or the charts or the tables or the results of any other statistical analysis are uh, presented in a separate window, the output window. Um, and you can see our pie chart here. We have five males, four females, and a total of nine valid observations. Remember we had ten people in our data set, but for one of them uh, we had a missing value, we didn't know the gender, so we can only work with nine variables. So this is why um, we have nine valid observations. So um, these are the percentages. The percentages out of the total number, um, or the, uh, the entire data set, and then the valid, per valid percentages if we work only with the valid observations. Males are represented in blue, and females are represented in green. If you just uh, want to use parts of this output, you can just click on um, the part of the output that you want to select, and then copy it, and paste it anywhere, like um, in a Word document for your homework, for instance. Um, or you could just save the output by going to File, and then Save. And you can save it anywhere on your computer. And in this case, it's going to include everything. Um, and here on the left side, you have a list of everything that is included in the output. All the tables, the graphs, and so forth.